what up folks, it's Alex here. Welcome to Mr. Alex Tech. I had a comment recently that was asking how to do a real simple gradient feathered edge within DaVinci Resolve. So I figured I'd make this quick video to show you how to do it. Now the first thing we need to do is just to stack these clips on top of each other. So I'm gonna grab my second one and just put it on top of the first one like so. Now what I'd then like to do is to just change the position so that everything lines up nicely. So the easiest way I've found to do that Give this top one a click, open up the inspector, top right hand corner, in composite at the very top, just reduce the opacity so that you can see both clips. So I can see both this top clip and the bottom clip. And now I can just arrange the position so everything sort of lines up. So I'm just going to shoot to my position here, I'm going to move this one over to the right a little bit. And we'll come down to look the second clip, move this one over to the left. And we're going to go with something like that. I'll then just select this top one and put the opacity back to where it was. But then I'm going to shoot into the color tab. And the first thing we need to do, select the top clip, which in my instance is this one here. We're then going to open up our nodes if they're not already open. And then you need to right click on an empty space, add an alpha output, and then drag this little blue box here down to this little blue circle like so. And what that essentially means is, now that we've got an alpha output, anything that's not within the selection that we make will be invisible, essentially revealing whatever's underneath, i.e. our second clip. So then we just need to add our gradient. Now that's really easy as well. All you need to do, come down to this middle menu here, and you want to select this one here, which is a window. And then you've got these options. It's this bottom one here. You can either select it from this menu here or this little icon, give that a click. And now you've got a nice, simple gradient. Now what you need to do, select this dot in the middle and you can move it around, put it wherever you want it. And then to change the angle and the strength of the gradient, all you do, click on the arrow head, we can change the angle and then we can lengthen that gradient or shorten it as well. So I'm gonna go somewhere in the middle there. We'll angle that off a little bit something like that and if we hit play there we go that's looking about right easy peasy job done thanks for watching hopefully that was useful if it was give me a thumbs up if you've got any short requests like this that you'd like to know pop them down in the comments below and i'll certainly see what i can do if this was useful and you're new maybe consider hitting that subscribe button thanks for watching take it easy i'll see you next time see ya